All right, family, get a news for Mary Dash 20, Mary Lee. I'm just doing all this documentation because you know, I believe in what goes around, come around. Right now, they having their little fun trying to um, do the best when it comes to killing me and shit. Now, as you can see, this is a advanced cancer care center, Illinois. But it got the 1512. Now, it is uh, 30 degrees outside and 1142. 42 and 1 and 1 is what? 44. So this is going out to the 44th president, Barack Obama. And you can see the Smith Medical Group Primary Care 773-978-0757. Now, if you add this up, uh, 15, 16, 17, 18, you understand what I'm saying? Could be some color purple shit. But y'all know they gave me cancer in uh, 2016. Now, nobody seems to care because that's what they said on the, uh, on the fucking goddamn psych ward at the Cook County Jail. What'd they say? But, uh, let's see what we got. We got 51, 52, 53, 54. We got 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We got, uh, uh, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. There we go. Coming from behind, 21 plus 5 and 1 is 27. My mother, Mary Lee Wright, was born, um, in 1927, and of course on her deathbed, my, uh, brother or whoever the fuck he was and my so-called sister Linda Nelson you know allowed her to have a cigarette and um I remember I had a, a so-called friend by the name of Melanie who I talked the game as far as you know selling taffy apples or whatever I put her on or whatever and stuff and she came and brought me a, a cigarette on my deathbed if that's what you want to call it back in the 90s like 96 or something like that yeah I remember that. So in the art of war, you don't repeat it. So there you go. And I made these people a lot of money or whatever and stuff. And they trying to just do the most with me. Now, I'm trying to figure out. They go Blue Cross Blue Shields. You know, this is how they taunt motherfuckers and shit. And across the street, that gate right there is 525, my birthday, of course. You understand what I'm saying? The design, the Versace sign or whatever the fuck. You understand what I'm saying? Real talk like this goddamn ring. It's my birthday right here on this ring. You see? Let me see. Yeah. The little one. So, you know, people hang around you because they gold diggers and shit. Real fucking so. So there you go. And then if you add it up, you know, twice or whatever and stuff, because you see the double. See the double? Yeah. So they can get rid of cancer and all that. This like Tupac said, y'all in the hell don't even know it. All you have to do is start the game from the beginning. And, you know, it's big business, but they was worried about my little business. You understand what I'm saying? They got in my business. I didn't get in their business. I spent money and shit. You understand what I'm saying with them? Now, I believe I dropped $20 at that Boost Mobile down the street. This girl, she left trying to read me and shit. Some black girl. And she came back in or whatever, you know. And of course, you know, they doing the most or whatever, talking crazy and shit, reckless and shit. But nothing moving until I move and saying like and shit up in these damn business. I know they're getting busy, but I'm just saying it's like everybody voice activated or whatever when it come to me or whatever and stuff. Now, I dropped the 20, but I know I gave her enough for my phone bill. And the girl was like, hey, you dropped the 20. But then when I looked to see the money that I gave for the phone bill, it was less. And I said, oh, okay, because ain't nobody going to tell you nothing unless it's a con in it or whatever and stuff. I said, if it was $100, what you had told me? She was like, yeah, but when I looked at the, um, and of course, tender windows. When I looked at, uh, she trying to say, oh, no, and every time you come in here, it's a problem. Well, don't worry, because I won't be going that motherfucker again, because I know I, they got an extra 20 and shit. Real fucking tough. You know, so the eye is quicker than the hand. And then, or oh, I should say the hand is quicker than the eye sometimes, depending on whatever the fuck. So these motherfuckers, they doing the most of shit. But it only, it's going, it's going, it's going to run out because 
you know, I'm a snap, crack, and pop once I ain't got no goddamn money. Real fucking tough. I'm telling you, they won't be out here like a fucking crackhead. And I promise you, when I die, we all die. I think that's how it's going to have to go, for real. Real talk, I just got to get one of these bitches to snap, crack, and pop with me and shit. Because I swear they've been watching too many videos and shit. They don't know me for real. They do not know me for real. See, these niggas think I done got old and shit. I'm just getting started, quiet as hell. So, yeah, they done got over and shit. And it's still looking broad up in there and shit. And they, you know, I ain't gonna lie, look like the motherfuckers on something and shit. Real fucking tough. And, you know, business is slow and we walk the damn and, you know, they trying to break a nigga. See the forest security, 708, 2000. Yeah, so I believe these motherfuckers just moved the fuck on. That's all they did. And opened up big business and with my money. So we're going to find out exactly what's going on. Because eventually... This little chump chain is gonna run the fuck out. And I'm not one to try to, um, you know, start over. Now, I'm worth too goddamn much. Now, we can fucking die. That's what we can do. Look at these crackheads. The only crackheads do shit like this. You understand what I'm saying? So, you know, you think they gonna tell me if I, I gave them too much or whatever the fuck, unless it's something to do with them? Look at this. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, they think they can get the game for free, but what they don't know is everybody gonna die when I die, because I swear I ain't got enough money to live. And these are motherfuckers on this bullshit, I promise you. We gonna fucking find out this shit, for real. You know, because they're not taking me seriously. Real fucking tote. You know, they is not taking me seriously. But I promise you, death is death, and bombs will drop. These motherfuckers scared to die, not me. So we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out because that motherfucker gold digger, uh, Lawanda, she thought she was slick. I mean, she was too goddamn quiet. Real fucking so. Her and Dwayne. And I knew they knew each other shit. I knew it. You know, it, I, I like a challenge, nigga. But bitch, once I done beat you to death, you might wanna stop fucking cheating. Real fucking so. But I done beat these bitches to death. And the day I go broke, everybody will be a fucking slave. And I believe that shit. Yeah, you know I mean, before I let these bitches play me for a fool, I swear to God, we'll do a reenactment of pull the fucking trigger, bitch. Real fucking soak. And if they didn't pull it in, which they should have, they damn sure ain't trying to pull it now. We're going to see what's up. Because you ain't getting no respect out of me with this bullshit. You ain't going to be talking reckless to me. I will beat one of these bitches' asses. For real. Real fucking tote. Alright, so I don't know how this going to work out. The ones who was um, a real Mary McMire, do what you got to do. That's all I got to say. If you got to blow one of these motherfuckers' heads off and shit, you have my permission. Fucking so.